Welcome top news today. A U.S. diplomat in Nairobi has resigned and blasted President Donald Trump over his human rights record. Elizabeth Shaq Ilford, who was in Nairobi over the past 10 months with the U.S. mission to Somalia, laments in a letter published by Foreign Policy Trump's recent pivot away from global diplomacy and their abandoning of human rights protections across the world. President Trump's dismissive attitude toward human rights was no surprise following his campaign, but your May 3rd remarks to department staff shocked many as you called in to question the utility of advancing human rights when it proves inconvenient. As a foreign policy professional, I understand better than most that we must balance competing interests, but human rights and democracy are fundamental elements of a safer world for our people. Her letter shows frustration and anger felt by many career diplomats at the State Department who are being marginalized and forced out by Trump's administration. While U.S. Secretary of State Rex Tillerson has claimed efforts to downsize the agency aimed to make it more efficient, the result, Shaq Ilford notes, has been a troubling weakening of U.S. diplomatic capabilities. The letter adds that the U.S. diplomatic corps has sadly ceded influence to the Pentagon at the behest of the White House but to our detriment as a nation, a senior official told Foreign Policy that Shaq Ilford was one of the most promising officers in the Foreign Service. Other colleagues said her departure is reflective of a lack of confidence at the State Department and its related agencies in both Tillerson and Trump. Shaq Ilford's last day on the job was Friday. Read U.S. military did not kill any civilians in August Somalia raid. Click here for latest political news.